Well, welcome back. Our Prep Rally Team Spotlight shines on a couple of teams playing on the biggest stage in all of girls' high school hoops, the Peoria Notre Dame Irish and the Illini Bluffs Tigers. All right, we're going to start with Peoria Notre Dame because Peoria Notre Dame has been ranked number one most of the year in girls' high school basketball in two ways. So they've been a team on a mission, a mission to get to Redbird Arena. Mission was accomplished on Monday night. In their super sectional game up at Bureau Valley, rough start, Jenna or Rock Island Allman jumped on top 11-2, but the Irish rallied. Caitlin Cassidy was terrific in the first quarter. I thought this was a huge shot late first half. In fact, at the buzzer, Lexi Bears three. The Irish run off the court down six instead of down nine. So 24-18 at halftime, and that lead for all of them would not last long because freshman Emmy Wardle took over. She scored back-to-back -back layups to start the second half and start the Irish on a dominant final 16 minutes of the game. Emmy Wardle scoring again. Julia Mingus hit a big three right here to put the Irish on top. Then it's going to be uh, Peoria Notre Dame's Lexi Bayer driving the baseline for two. And how about Emmy DeMaia? Wardle to Wardle for this fast break three-point play. The Irish win the super sectional title. Today, for the first time in school history, Peoria and Notre Dame plays in the state final four. Let's head to Steph Q Arena for today's action. Peoria and Notre Dame playing Regina Dominican, a Chicago Catholic school, and this one was all Irish. First time down the court, Lexi Bear hit one of her six three-pointers. Then it was the Irish defense. Julia Mingus had a terrific game. She gets a steal. She's driving for a layup. Later, it's going to be Maya Wardle, a steal and a layup. The Irish scored 30 points off turnovers, 20 fast break points. They won the game 71-25. to It all starts with a D in PND, the defense. Defense is kind of our identity. I think that when we get stops and we get steals and we push it, that's when we're at our best. Um, and it's easier to make shots when you, you're locking them down. And we forced them into almost 15 turnovers at the half, which is, which is pretty good. And that definitely sparked us. Monday was the first day of spring practice, the first day of softball practice. Illini Bluffs, a back-to-back-to-back -back -back softball state finalist. But Softball's kind of on the back rearview mirror right now because it's still basketball season at IB. The Illini Bluffs Tigers taking on the number one ranked team in the state, Galena, at the Brimfield Super Sectional on Monday night. And Annabelle Fortin ahead to Chloe Eaton. First half ends with Fortin a three-pointer, and that put the Tigers up 18-16 at half. And second half, they just kept coming on. Annabelle Fortin, another three. How great has she been in this her senior year? Then Lily Lakowiak, the drive and the bucket, but defense was the real key for IB. Watch Chloe Eaton, the steal and the drive. Lakowiak had 21. Illini Bluffs, a super sectional champ, beating the number one ranked team in the state. That earned Illini Bluffs a trip today to Redbird Arena in the state finals. They got up early for the 9.30 a.m. game. Let's check out the Tigers in the final four. Illini Bluffs trailed in their game versus Altamont nearly the entire game, but they would rally. They would rally in the fourth quarter behind Lily Lakowiak. Lakowiak was brilliant in the game. She had 27 points, 11 rebounds, three steals. Game goes to overtime in overtime. The Tigers win it. 60 to 48. I talked to the star of the game, Lily Lakowiak, moments after the semifinal victory. All of these games that has led up to this game have been back and forth and really close and really tight. And I think that that helps us in these types of situations. And having that confidence in each other and that trust helps us get here. How does it feel, state championship game? It's it's unreal. I mean, I'm just so happy and excited. I'm like honestly, nerves have not been a part of this like I am eager to play I'm excited to play with these girls and I'm ready to take it home Saturday <laughs> 